right. Yeah. Well, you look, your face isn't looking as uh, sunken in today, mate. No. Better. <laughs> More alive. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, actually, you were quite sprightly that day. You were quite, you had great, I think, well, because you just bloody won, that's why. And you had 10,000 gram of carbs. Yeah. No, I felt good. That, that show, I felt pretty good. Yeah. Because uh, it was like a surprise. Because uh, I, I got seventh place in New York, and then I was like, I just did my best, and I had no pressure. Mm -hmm. And I think for the Olympia, I was more like, I've been prepping for so long, it was pretty hard at the end, to be honest. Yeah. Yeah, Cali was fun though. It was it was nice, my first pro win. So of course I'll be, I was happy. I mean, I've I've I've, I've interviewed over the last couple of years, and I've, it's been so nice to see your continual kind of um, your continual rise. So, okay, sorry, we just had uh, delivery there on a Sunday, so uh, I was a bit distracted there because somebody <laughs> somebody was running past the studio. So yeah, sorry, you seen uh, saying from the Olympia. By the time you got to the Olympia, you've been on prep that long. You said your body was just tired. Yeah, well, it's just I started my prep December 18, 2019. Oh, shit. And then I was aiming for some shows that got pushed back, like, you know, you know, you know why. Mm. Uh, then I just kept prepping, and then I prepped again, and then did the Cali, then prepped again. So, so the show, the Olympia was December 18, 2020, mm. and I started at December 18, 2019. Oh, my God, 12 months. And during those 52 weeks, I had 10 weeks of like uh, I was like just off and just kind of rest hmm. but the other 42 I was paled with metal <laughs> yeah so, so I mean have you been just obviously been like, getting a good rest since the Olympia I assume oh uh, yeah yeah I think it's more easy I ate you know some good amount of food there I'm already 300 pounds <laughs> yeah, so I was, I, yeah I was 300 pounds like three weeks after wow yeah I, I, the thing is I, I didn't eat too much well I guess I did, but is it, I, I feel like I'm not, I go to 300 pounds. It's just like my casual, like walking around normal weight now. Yeah. Yeah. It's just like, I, I don't, I don't try to be there. Cause the first time I went to 300 pounds, I remember I was eating so much trying to get there, hmm. but now I'm like pull, pull, pulling back on the food and I'm still 300 pounds. Good. And I'm starting in uh, three to four weeks. So I'm going to, my starting point will be 300 pounds. Wow. So what did you weigh at the Olympia then? 270. 270? Because you've got things you're like 6'1, aren't you? I have six foot. Six you're six foot tall. Shit, that's quite heavy, mate. That's big. Yeah, well the thing is they like, only Rami was heavier than me. <laughs> only Rami, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Two yeah, the thing is because my because my weak points are <laughs> are here, right here in the back. My weak points and the arms and stuff, my upper body is uh I don't look like cause and a lot of the guys who are shorter, they're so big here, they have like a plate of armor, I call it. <laughs> and uh, this is where I lack the most. So, yeah. When I would do some poses, I would uh, show a lot of my weakness like that. Oh, this guy he needs to fill up his frame pretty much. Could so I'm probably gonna need to be like two, two eighty pounds. Yeah. Well, okay, and it was it has to be like all in these places, right? Especially the chest. Because if you look at Akeem's chest, I was backstage. I was looking at him. His chest is like this thick. <laughs> <laughs> Two yeah. watermelons. Yeah, two watermelons, and then when he flexes, straight into watermelons. Wow. I was like, yeah. <laughs> like and the thing I noticed though is that my condition was was good though, because I was backstage mm. looking at the glutes and hams of the other guys, I was like, Yeah, I'm good. But then on stage, because I don't have enough muscle pushing everything on the upper body, it didn't it didn't push through. Like Akeem backstage it didn't look hard. But then he would flex on stage, and all the muscles would be pushing out, making it look like really conditioned. Yeah. So I need a lot more muscle. That's what I learned from the Olympia. It's like, okay, well, I gotta stop trying to be just like, um, just the the, the shredded like, uh, try to be aesthetic guy because that's not what's winning shows. They want big. No, big no, 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 no. Your calling card is your aesthetics, mate, because you are a big guy at 270 pounds. You're a yeah. big guy. You got great yeah. aesthetics, fantastic legs. You just need more chest and back, mate. That's it. Yeah, yeah, I know. But the thing for that, you need to get a lot of muscles. And I mean, my structure will stay the same. And for the the waist, I I'm learning that I think high blood sugar levels contributes to the the big waist.